welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, and welcome to Eric Blackman Guitar. In this session, I will show you my way of playing the Drifters 1962 version of a Carol King classic, Up on the Roof. The guitar is tuned standard, E A D G B E, and the key is A flat. So let's get started. We'll start the song by strumming an A flat major chord like this. We're playing that A flat major chord by holding down the B in high E string at fret 4, the G string at fret 5, and the D string at fret 6. Now sometimes you'll see me put my thumb over the top of the guitar like this. That's just to mute the strings because my thumb is long enough to do that. You don't need to do that. All you need to do is this. But you've got to be really careful that you're strumming only those strings. Alright, now what I do is I put that thumb across there and I don't have to be very careful about how I'm strumming. Now the strumming pattern is down, up, down, up, down, up. 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 And that's how we're going to get our song started. When the verse starts, we're going to go to A flat. A flat six. D flat. And B flat minor then back to A flat. We started with our A flat chord and we went to an A flat 6 by taking the little finger and putting it on fret 6 on the B string. We'll do a D flat chord by playing the uh, A string at fret 4 and barring the D, G, and B string at fret 6. Like that. You can play this chord this way with the bar or you can just use an easy version by barring the D, the G, the B string at fret 6. That's all you need. So You just gotta strum those strings though. And then we're going to need a B flat minor. And we're getting that by barring fret 6 as far as the G, B, and high E strings are concerned. Like that. For all the verses, we'll strum the chords this way. Down, up, down, up, down, up, strumming pattern. Next, we'll go to the bridge, and we'll play the bridge this way. The 
for that part, we're going to have to go up the neck to a D flat chord. And that's the same form we used earlier. Except we're playing it at fret 9 on the B and high E, fret 10 on the G string, and fret 11 on the D string. We're going to add the little finger for a D flat 6 on the B string at fret 11. We'll play a D flat major 7 this way. We have a finger on the high E string at fret 8, the B string fret 9, the G string fret 10, and the D string fret 11. That's D flat major 7. And we'll go back to our D flat 6. So here's that part. After that, we'll go back down to our A flat and play A flat 6, D flat, like that. So that's D flat, D, E flat. So that's. Then we'll go back into the verses. For the ending of the song, we'll play this. Well, that's all I've got for this one, guys. Thanks for stopping by, and have a great day.